Okay, uh, so what we're going to do now is a couple of small events as well as revisiting pretty much every town in the world to pick up items from people. So I'll, I'll probably just be cutting back and forth between people in town and and just jump right ahead to each one rather than showcase wandering around. This will still take a little bit. So we're going to start with the Pazion and just uh, jump from there. So we're looking for the Cursing Soldier to start with. There we are. We found a rock under here just now. I think someone might have dropped it. Who would walk around trying to find something like this? Here, you take and get rid of it. Gale Shard. Right here in Jada, we're one talking to the disappointed soldier. It was looking strange a while ago, but I have no idea how to use it, so I'll give it to you. Here was a potion. Well, you throw it on yourself in battle. Alright, in the command room, in the, in the military zone, talk to the nervous watchman. I found this while I was organizing the books. Please take it. And a strength leaf. Much appreciated. Alright, here in Diamant at the port, talk to the sailor girl. Like a weird thing to see, but I can't really understand how to use it. Here, you can have it. For a flood shard. Well, we'll fuse that together, hopefully. Alright, in the Diamant Fountain Square, we come to a home next to the, uh, next to the magic shop. To talk to the singing girl. A friend of mine left me this. I don't know how to use it, so I'll give it to you. That's really... that's what all these boil down to. Alright, in the, a, in the industrial zone, talk to the depressed soldier. It came at just the right time. I don't know what to do with this. Here, you can have it. I can assure it's quality, but I'm afraid I can't tell you how it came into my possession. Insight Leaf. Moving on. Alright, in Samuel's Martial Arts School, talk to the motivated girl right here. I found something straight on the ground. I don't know how to use it, so I'll give it to you. Or a full liquid. Alright, so in Diamond Castle, there's actually one event and two weapons we can get right now. They're both in the near where we got Vice's Guard for Lark. So on the right side, on the castle room. You're First Sergeant Lagoon, yes? The mercenary who was authorized by the Imperial family? Not anymore. I'd like to speak to General Freya. General Freya? Certainly. Please wait here. I know Lord Alpha's away. What brings you here? General Freya. This isn't where you should be. What do you mean? I need to talk to you. Me? Not Nico. Is he safe? I heard he was taken to the Skywalk. Nico's gone. He protected the man in exchange for his life. <sighs> he told me to tell you he was sorry to put you through so much trouble. Oh, did he? Did Nico say that? General, Nico was secretly giving you information about us, right? Yep, even Lark figured it out. Oh, you knew. But I don't want you to misunderstand. Nico wasn't doing it to get you in trouble. Sir Vice ordered him. Sir Vice? Sir Vice was monitoring you because he was worried about you. He really had good intentions. Nico was uneasy with his task and always wanted to quit. He always felt like he was betraying you. Nico, you idiot. I made him monitor you. Please don't blame him. I have no right to be critical of him. I pushed him too hard. This drove him into a corner and then finally to his death. <sighs> General. Leslie, was it? Your other companion used the gun? Please give this to her. This is... I was going to give it to Nico. I'm sure it will help you along your journey. The Benix. General Freya, we'll continue our journey now. The world turned out like this, but we have to go on. Now don't put yourself in danger. Nico wouldn't be happy if you did. Okay, goodbye for now. Wait, I really enjoyed Nico's stories. Not the stories about gods or special missions. I like the stories about his adventures. Stories about dinner menus and flowers growing in the streets. I said they were pointless, but I actually liked them. I really look forward to hearing the stories. Yeah. That sounds like Nico. Thank you for telling me about it. Lark Bright Lagoon, I pray that you have a safe journey. Now go and save this world. Roger that. So, while we didn't really have anything to tell Elena about Nico, I think this one was very nice. And thankfully we will not get ambushed in the throne room. Let's go ahead and pick up what was left behind there. Pretty sure it's in the throne room. It's, uh, yeah, right, right here. The Holy Noir. Oh, ooh, ooh. Uh, they'll like boost force and boost summon, so quite nice for rogue spamming. 
and force the Benix. Frequent use of Excel Act. Fixed SP50. Very nice if you want to unleash a, a, a low cost SP skill at the start of battle. If it's a nice area of effect, yeah, you should be able to kill a lot of things right away. Go ahead and master those off camera as well. But for now, yeah, we'll just jump off to the next area, pick up the next item. All right, here in Copen Village, we want to talk to the Happy Copen. This is a bit random, so let me take a couple tries. Nope, oh, take the Fortune Leaf. And we'll just uh, spam this until we get it. I think you have to get oh, three for three. I'm not going to read all these out. Just keep at it, keep at it. Nope, oh, well, three, one, one. Come on, come on. Well, uh, all three for two. Hey, we, we got that one already. And I don't know what the odds are, but, oh, yep. We're, we're seeing repeats. Come on. Oh, we were, we were two for three on three. All right, that's even worse. Keep mashing that button, we'll get it eventually. There we go. So lucky you, you have a surprise present from the Copens. All that for a terror shard. Fortunately, we just had to mash the button. <laughs> All right, uh, let's uh, jump ahead. Uh, so here in Carbunculus, talk to the captain's daughter, finally on this side of the port. I found a really pretty bottle at the bottom of Dad's ship. It's apparently a very strong drug, but I don't like bitter drugs, so I'm giving it to you. First one's free. <laughs> All right, here in the industrial area, find the hardworking man. He looks really tired. Here, you should take a sip of this. I'm giving you something the city workers only get as a gift. Another full liquid. I'll take it. All right, in the Senate Parliament Hall, talk to the thinking watchman. Seems like the war is over. May I give you some items I brought in preparation for the war? I don't want to waste them. Finally, someone who knows what the item is. All right, in the Senate Conference Hall, we'll just uh, crash their meeting and check out this bookcase here. For another insight leaf. Right. Still, still not done, Carbonco. Let's keep going. All right, finally on Opera Boulevard, talk to the studious child. My mom gave me a book called Ten Ways to Become Rich. There was a strange card in the book to penance, but here, I don't want it. You can take it. Nice card. All right, we're done, Carbunculus. All right, here at Bennett Nash Cemetery, talk to the cat lover. The cat just brought me the most beautiful leaf. I think I wanted, I think I wanted to give it to you. Yeah, vitality leaf, much appreciated. Here at the Bataki's abandoned base, talk to the pessimistic soldier. Ah, Commander gave me some strange medicine. I'm too scared to use it. You can have it. Well, strength potion is nice. And still in Betrachides in the residential area, talk to the diplomatic woman. As long as we have the Imperial Charger, I don't need any of my belongings. Here, you can have this. Well, it'll keep you alive, but we'll take it. Alright, in the manufactory in Everett, talk to the fire copen. Feeling hopeless about my bogged down life. I look up to the sky, then. Feathers flutter down. Please take one as a souvenir. Ah, Phoenix Wing! Here in Opolis, talk to the explaining girl. The pretty jewel came flying down with the snow. It's a broken piece of gem, right? I can't use it, so I'll give it to you. At least she knows what it is. All right, that's all. He that's all for here. All right, in Ferris, talk to the aloof woman in the corner here. So your lark. It's not much, but I brought something to help you. A sandcastle? Is that our first one of those? It is. So block all attack. Ooh, quite nice. Alright, at the Waning Crescent Inn, talk to the woman looking up. I bought this medicine just in case, but now there's no need for it. I'll give it to you if you want it. I sure do. Defense. Oh, well, that's not medicine, but I'll take it. Here in the ruins of Hilbert, I actually forgot to pick up a treasure chest. Or a stone gem. Alright. Continue on. So back in the ruins of Hilbert, way in the back where we first found Shelly, talk to Kazif. Long time no see, Lark. We've prepared something useful for you. The fight would likely go on. We must win! Oh, an all charge. Very appreciative. And, oh, what the hell was that accent? <laughs> but, that's not, that's not all. 19th Nomad Sun. Aren't you the resistance leader, Lark Bright Lagoon? How lucky me to, me to see such a famous person. Here, I'll give you this map. Oh, wait, you already got one. Uh, let me see. Oh, this map is old and missing some vital parts. Here, let's change this new one with yours. So, yep, updated 
ruins of Hilbert map. All right, uh, last stop, Antrax. All right, here in Antrax in the residential, let's talk to the yachting soldier. Oh, I got this weird looking thing earlier. I had no clue how to use it, so I'll just let you have it. Same dialogue as usual. I'll take an Inferno Shard. Alright, in the Mercantile Zone, talk to the sharp-eyed watchman. I saw something shiny at my feet, turns out it was this thing. I don't really need it. Oh, I know. You always took time to talk to me, so I'll let you have it. Well, even if you talked to her before, she still gives it to you. I'll take it. And finally, in the uh, Cathedral Plaza, talk to this Imperial Craftsman. I found this under a big pile of rubble. I don't know what it's for, but it'd be ways to throw it away. Here, I guess you can have it. And another full liquid. So, that concludes our Fruitful World Tour. We'll be ready to advance the plot in the next main part. I'm going to do all the off-camera stuff, build up all those weapons. And we'll see you guys for when we check out that continent in the middle of the world.